up everyone um it is eight o'clock eight o'clock exactly and i'm heading over to the gym this morning one because well you know i always lift in the morning and two i have a client to train this morning um it'll be in the rec and normally in the mornings um the rec has a rule against me training people personally so what she and us are helping okay Oh, I, I'm getting completely off topic right now. I do that so many times. Okay, but I'm going to the gym. Um, this morning will be leg day. Um, I like working legs with this client. Um, I'll explain why later. But uh, she needs it. She actually needs it uh, for some coming up. And yeah, so we're gonna train legs this morning. Um, I might do deadlifts. Or hamstrings, I not hamstrings. I might do hamstrings or quads. I don't know entirely yet, but once I do, I'll just do it. Um, I will be recording. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching, and I'm hoping you're enjoying this one. Thanks for watching again. I hope you enjoy this. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. Yeah, below. You know, my right, fitness. Get ready for the workout. It's leg like day. Yeah. Yeah, so what's up guys, for the first movement of this workout, I did deadlifts. I haven't really focused too much on my hamstrings on the deadlifts. I would always try and lift with my back, so I've stopped ego lifting, and I've returned to 315, where it's like heavy, and it's not like super heavy, so I can't just like start ego lifting all the time. So for this one, I did four sets of six working sets with 315. I warmed up with 135 and 225, but then I went up to 315 where I just focused on engaging my hamstrings and not even lifting because I'm really tired of that, you know? I, I just want to get stronger, look nice, and have chiseled <laughs> hamstrings. So yeah, that was it for this one. Four sets of six, and then one set of failure at the end with 225. And that was it. And then we went on to the next move. For the next movement, I did single leg hamstring curls standing. I normally like doing them lying down, but I felt like standing for on today. So I did six sets of six. Again, I'm not going fairly heavy. I like getting a contraction and engaging my hamstrings when I do these. I'm really not trying to ego lift, guys. I'm so bad. But yeah, so six sets of six. And each time I bring it up, I'd pause at the top and then bring it back down. Pausing to get that nice low squeeze, trying to get the muscle bigger, trying to get some blood into it. So for the next movement, which I did while I was doing my single leg hamstring curls, was standing calf raises. I did six sets of 10 on these, trying to get a nice tight squeeze at the top. And I was bouncing up and down like um, you see most people do. So I'd go up, hold it, then come back down, up, down. So, trying to get a nice little squeeze in the calves too. So the last movement I did in this workout for my hamstrings was seated single leg uh, hamstring curls. Now this, this is completely new to me and I'm not used to it because normally the machine has a little bar and then you do that. I don't have the machine in my rack anymore. So, I had to adjust and I'm still trying to learn how to work with it. Yesterday was my first day, so it was pretty nice. I did get a nice little squeeze after, and you could feel it, I could feel it blocking away um, that I did target the muscle correctly. I did six sets of eight, I believe, for this one. I wanna say six to seven sets of eight, I don't really remember, but I did do eight and each leg, and then that was it. That was basically the workout. Yeah, so that was basically the workout, guys. No. <laughs> um, I don't like doing too many things just to target one muscle. I'll do three to four movements and that's it. And I'll get as many reps and as heavy weight as I can, but never like, let's say, six movements. I'm in the gym for an hour and 30 minutes. That's it, every day. Well, two times a day. Two times a day, one hour and 30 minutes, so about three hours in total every day. But that was it. That was basically just targeting the muscle, trying to get blood into it, getting it bigger and nicer. 
and it's, it's lean bulk season time, you know. I don't have a competition for a while, and I'm enjoying the time off, eating, getting bigger. I've actually gained five pounds within this one week, but it hasn't been fat. Um, you know what? Next video, physique update. I'll do that, you know. I'll show you guys my current physique. I'm not mad at it at all. Yeah, I'm not as shredded as I was competition time, but I was around 4% body fat during competition. And I don't want to go back down to that for a while. I've, I've missed this happiness that I'm having right now, you know. So, yeah, that was basically it, guys. I'm hoping you're enjoying this. Because I'm enjoying making the videos. I'm having fun again. Secretly hiding my phone within the wreck to record myself lift, just so you guys can have some footage. I need a haircut. Yeah, it's gonna be haircut time soon. So yeah, <laughs> thanks again guys. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and follow me on my social media accounts, which I have down below. I don't know, I don't know if I'll put it here, or if it'll be in the box, like, you know, the little box that's like right under everything. So, yeah. <laughs> thanks again for watching guys, and I'll catch you next time. Hello.